Mr. Boo and Orange Pico. Two cats, one battle, and only one can come out on top. Who will win in this ultimate comparison? Find out soon. Now, popular consensus among the cat community is clear at this point. Orange Pico is the winner. That's what it says, and that's why he's ranked at the tip top of my cat list. However, after spending some time around him, I've gotta say, I'm not so sure about that. Don't get me wrong, he's cute, he's sweet, and the longer you're around him, the nicer he gets. But then, there's Mr. Boo. Over the years, this man has fallen down the ranks and faded from relevancy. Still, going back to him, I was shocked at how great he is, and really, I think the difference between these two are simple. At first glance, Pico is more exciting and high energy, the type of guy most cat lovers can see and go, yeah, this is fun, I like that. Boo, by contrast, is a lot more laid back, relaxed, and even slow paced. And yet, within that slow pace, there's a willingness to explore some surprising topics, which comes through not due to his perfection, but due to what many see as his flaws. See, Mr. Boo needs two eye drops a day in one of his eyes because of a medical condition. He also had to have one of his canines removed because it got cracked before we got him. Sometimes he just chooses to not cover his crap in the litter box. And yet, these supposed flaws don't make him less interesting. Instead, looking deeper, there's a willingness to tackle serious topics and to give answers to questions that are a bit more risky, a bit less clear cut. Meanwhile, Pico is out here and sure, he doesn't have eye troubles, he isn't missing a tooth, he covers his crap in the litter box, but what if I told you that perhaps he's been ironed out to the point of losing some of the original's appeal? But don't get my meaning mixed up. I like both of these cats, but for different reasons. Perhaps I'm just frustrated that my guy Mr. Boo, the older one, the original, is out here getting disrespected, while Pico soaks up the glory. And maybe it's worthwhile to go back and check out Mr. Boo again. There's certainly enough belly rubs to go around for both of them.